Do you want to save potentially thousands of dollars a year on seltzer? Are you so much of a seltzer snob that you refuse to give up your favorite brand? Hey there, NJMoo22.com here with another quick vlog. Today is going to be really quick. We're going to talk about seltzers. Um, some people, a lot of people drink seltzers. It's a, uh, these calorie free bubbly beverages with a little bit of a subtle flavor. Um, we use seltzers only in our alcoholic drinks. We rarely drink them straight for refreshment. We're usually coffee, coffee people, heavy cream only, sometimes some cinnamon in it uh, or water. Those are the things we drink. Uh, se spiked seltzers, regular seltzers mixed in coffee and water. That's the only beverage or tea, 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 tea bags too. Unsweetened uh, iced teas. I came across these uh, ShopRite brand uh, seltzers. Uh, my two favorite flavors, by the way, are coconut, which is very nice, and cucumber melon, which tastes more like uh, honeydew melon uh, than, and I don't think there's any cucumber in there uh, from, from what I tasted. But these things, uh, we picked them up there, you know, like 69 cents uh, a, a liter over at Chopper, uh, 1.05 quarts. That works out to a little over two cents an ounce, which is, which is nice. Um, that's about the cheapest you'll find these seltzers for, even when you buy multiple 12 packs on sale. It hover, hovers around the two cents per ounce mark. And did you know that these uh, ShopRite seltzers are actually on sale right now, just till uh, Saturday? Uh, they're five for two bucks. That's 40 cents a liter, that's a little over, it's like 1.2 cents a, uh, an ounce. You can't beat that price. Buy a hundred of them, they'll last you a long time. But some people in our family like this Perrier. Uh, and I don't even know if it's a liter. It's 25 ounces, so, and oftentimes this is, you know, 250 or $3 a bottle at rip-off places like King's. So that's like t 10 cents an ounce for this imported uh, sparkling water. And I'm just wondering if, if people have, uh, if, they, if they're interested in saving money, let's just say you drink one bottle a day. The difference between these two seltzers here is around you know, 700 bucks a year. And if you drink more than, than uh, one bottle a day, or if you have a family of, of people that like drinking seltzers, it could be in the neighborhood of a th you know, several thousand dollars a year if you switch this no-name brand uh, or house brand ShopRite seltzer. I don't know why you wouldn't want to do it. I actually think these taste better. And also, if you're used to it, and this is your favorite brand, and when you try other brands, you don't like it, stick with the new brand for a week. You won't even remember um, the, your old brand anymore, and you'll be just, just as fine with these, and you'll be happier saving money. And if you don't do anything with that money, if you have so much money you don't know, uh, you can't keep track of it, why don't you send some our way, uh, support our channel a little bit. Uh, I switched over to Instant Coffee, a long time ago, I can't tell the difference. It tastes like Starbucks to me. So there's your money saving tip of the day. Have a good weekend.